The other thing that I got really interested in was portal hubs. This is a design from a company called 74 Weld, and they make race portals for trophy trucks. And the advantage to a portal is just like on a Humvee, you gear down at the hub. So you're reducing the stress on your gears and your axles out at the wheel rather than just relying on the diff. And so once I started thinking about what I wanted to do with this design, it was clear to me that I wanted to run portals in conjunction with this tall knuckle design because that would allow me to run the biggest tires possible, which are these Mickey Thompson Baja Pro XS. These are 58 inch tires. And these are the biggest tires that anybody's ever made. And so I've always had this idea in my head, especially in off-road racing applications, why limit yourself to a 40 inch tire like you see on most trophy trucks? Maybe that's a rule book thing where they're limited in terms of tire size, but I think these guys are inching their way up like 41, 42s. And if you've been following Baja for a long time, like since the inception, these guys used to run 35s. So why not find the limit of tire size that you can run? Now, a 58 inch tire, that's a lot of rubber. It's going to be really heavy. I think he specifies this tire as weighing like 250 pounds or something like that. So it's a lot of weight to be bouncing up and down on the end of a suspension assembly. And it's a lot of radius to be turning. So that's why I wanted to go with the tall knuckle and the portal design because the tall knuckle decreases the stress from this giant tire and the portal hub decreases the torque on the axles from turning this giant tire so really the only guys that run stuff this big are rock crawlers i don't even think the rock bouncer guys use these rock bouncer guys will use 44 inch tires like the super swampers or there's these really cool ones from kryptonite yeah so these are 46s from kryptonite and it's a super sticky compound they're really big a lot of guys carve them out to make them lighter and these are 185 pounds it's pretty heavy and there's a saying in off-road racing bigger tires are the only way to make the bumps smaller 